Hey, this is Scott Wenkiewicz and I've got a very quick video for you today. And it is a very simple tip about something that you should bring whenever you're out making photographs. The one thing that you should bring is this. Now, this looks like a little hard drive. It's actually not a hard drive. Um, this is actually a battery backup for a mobile phone. As you can see, it actually has two USB ports on this one. Now I actually have two of these type of things. I have one that is from Goal Zero, which has one USB port and it is weather resistant. I can actually clip it onto a bag with the USB port down, um, sort of like this, USB port is down and I can clip it down that way. Water's not going in the USB port. It's just dripping down off the top, which is weather resistant. Um, and the reason why is we're using our phones for different things. We're either using it to trigger um, or, or you trigger your camera or we're using it to uh, plot a location or we're using our phones as our camera or we're using it for GPS or we're using it for this or for that or whatever. Um, so our batteries are draining nonstop. Maybe you're using it for a model release like I do. I use my phone for all my model releases or my iPad, depending on if I'm in the studio or not. And um, so I carry two. They're, they're not the lightest things in the world. There are smaller ones, but I like having one that has a good enough battery to charge my phone for, a, you know, a day or two of, of charge if I needed. Um, and so I actually have this little pouch from Think Tank Photo. It's the Cable Management 20. There are many uh, versions of this net now, but when I got this, there was only two available. Um, and I keep actually, when I'm traveling, I keep uh, both of my battery chargers, battery backups in it, plus the cables I need, um, including my lightning cables, uh, everything inside of this one pouch. And that way it's just in my bag, it's light. I can even carabiner to the outside of the bag if I need to and and just go. And, and I know that I have enough juice to get me through the day or a, a couple days if I really needed to, if power went out or something like that. Uh, now this has actually saved me many times when in my own house when the battery, when the power went out during bad weather, where I would actually tether the internet from my phone to my laptop and um, and actually use my use these battery backups to keep my phone charged. So they actually come in handy in many ways, many many uh, type of situations. But it's really important that when you're traveling, if you're making photographs somewhere, you have that with you. You always need to have extra batteries with you for your phone because your phone could also be your lifeline in a case of emergency. So think about it, pick one up. I have the one from Goal Zero, Zero. I will link to it in the in the description. And I also have this one from Anchor, which is um, uh, probably more affordable, but this one actually has two, two USB ports, which is a nice thing. So I've actually been able to charge my phone and a friend's phone at the same time uh, when I really needed to out in the field. So uh, check that out. Thanks for watching.